on air bubbles. And I am a material girl. The panel tried their best to pop me. Heidi from Sugar Babes. Georgia Toffolo. Nita Rani. I think it's probably Emily Ata. But they haven't burst me yet. A material world. Welcome to my pink palace. Ah, pop. Maybe it could be a musician. Forget Gen Y and Z. This Gen Bubble follows all the trends. What's hot? Spicy bubble tea. Yummy! Social media star, maybe disco ball. Yeah, I'm thinking strictly... And what's not? Oily, fishy tea. Ugh. Not cool. It's not just me, there's a small bubble of us girls. Rock and roll. Rizzle. Rizzle kicks. Time to burst onto the stage. And prove I'm not your average beverage. Ah. Tea. I can't tell if you are yet. Yeah, it's not not quite as comfy as Al, but I'll hug you anyway. <laughs> Lovely. That was amazing. I yeah. love that. Davina, I'm going to come to you first. Freak out. I love that performance. I loved it because I felt like you started a little bit nervous, and by the end, you were like, yeah. okay, I know what I'm yeah. doing. I feel really confident. I'm really enjoying myself. So well done. That was absolutely yes. brilliant. So I saw tapes all with all the different types of music, but one of them said rock and roll. Her father-in-law is the ultimate rock star. And Rizzles, so Rizzle Kicks, Jordan Stevens is in Rizzle Kicks, and he yeah. was on her podcast. I think it's Fern Cotton. Oh. That is a good guess. Fern Cotton. Bo, what are you thinking? That was yes. so good. You're yeah. bringing the V-I-B-E-S. You're bringing the vibe. So there was the whole Gen Z vibe. And did you guys see the disco ball? Yeah. So that led me down the route of Strictly. That's right, I think it could be Maisie Ooh. Smith. Oh, yeah. That's who I'm going for. Jennifer, who do you think it is? 
honestly, I haven't a clue, because looking at the um, <laughs> clues, she get about the gens, and I was wondering if that means she's a Jennifer, is it Jennifer <gasps> Lopez? Jennifer Lopez. Is it not Jennifer, Jennifer Lopez? <laughs> is it Jennifer Aniston? Is it Jennifer Coolidge? I mean, obviously, I'm on the WhatsApp group. <laughs> <laughs> I've muted Lopez, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> I, <laughs> I thought Spice, Bubbles. I, I was thinking Jane Horrocks. Is it Jane Horrocks? Because she played Bubble. In a little show you might have heard of called Absolutely Fabulous, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. <laughs> Jonathan, I love your outfit. I love your energy. That was a great performance. We were all up and dancing, enjoying what you were doing with it. There's loads of clues. You said, stop the press. I thought, is it someone who does TV or maybe news on the TV? And then when said, I like spicy tea. Yeah. And at the beginning, the very first thing that bubble tea said was, yeah, baby. Baby spice. Emma Bunton, ladies Emma and gentlemen. Bunton. Emma Bunton. Fancy uh, some more clues? Yes, please. Yes, OK, fancy a game of clue or false. OK, Bubble Tea, let's hear your first tuck shop rumour, please. ST and Bubble Tea are sitting in a tree. K-I-S-S-I-N-G. Who's ST? Who's an ST? Do we know any S famous STs? ST. Who's ST? I'll give you one more clue. I'll give you two guesses for why I'm never first on the team sheet. Mm. Audience, do you think number one is true? Yeah. Can you cheer if you think number two is true? Yeah. Four people. S OK. S if we go with that, ST must be the initials of someone. Who's yeah. an ST? Who do we know is an ST? Steven Tyler from I'm Aerosmith. Steven Tyler. No. Keep thinking, guys. Keep thinking. What's bubbling beneath the surface? We'll only know when the mask comes off. Let's hear it for Bubble Tea, everyone. Yes, yeah. Bubble Tea! Are the panel topioca of the class with these guesses, or are they just bursting with bad ideas? Who do you think's behind the mask? Jennifer thought my little voice could be Jane Horrocks. What an absolutely fabulous 